let's see a question from integration we need to integrate sine of x minus alpha divided by sine of x plus alpha so this is a very easy problem just one thing you have to keep it in mind that to solve this question try to create denominator in numerator that means you have denominator as sine of x plus alpha try to create this denominator in numerator how can we do that we can rewrite our numerator as sine of this is x plus alpha i can write what i did i just added one extra alpha so i will have to subtract one alpha so one alpha is already there subtracted one more alpha if i subtract so i can write that as minus 2 alpha because one minus alpha was already there and one minus alpha because i added extra alpha okay now in denominator i will have sine of x plus alpha and i have a dx and alpha is a constant so you need to keep that in mind now i know the formula of trigonometry which is sine of a minus b because this i want to take one this i want to take one so sine of a minus b is sine a cos b minus cos a sine b so if i use that i will get sine a so sine of x plus alpha cos b so cos of 2 alpha minus cos a so cos of x plus alpha sin b that is sin 2 alpha divided by sin of x plus alpha now you can uh, distribute this uh, you can divide it separately by denominator so you will get first term divided by denominator so sin of, of x plus alpha will get cancelled you will get cos 2 alpha dx minus cos by sin is cot so cot x plus alpha and uh, with that you will have an extra sin 2 alpha dx now cos 2 alpha is a constant so i can take that out simply get integral of dx minus sin 2 alpha is also constant i can take that out also i will get cot x plus alpha so integration of dx is x so i will get x cos 2 alpha integration of cot something cot linear thing because if you substitute x plus alpha as t you will simply get dx equals to dt okay so because this is linear i can directly rewrite this i can treat this entire thing as x only so this sin 2 alpha as it is and integration of uh, this is log sin so log sin x plus alpha plus a constant c so this is uh, the value of my integration which is x cos 2 alpha minus sin 2 alpha multiplied by log sin x plus alpha plus a constant c is always there so i hope you understood this question we just created denominator and numerator and that's it Uh, the question was pretty easy just the basic idea of trigonometry integration of cot x you already know is log sin x i hope you understood this question thanks and have a very nice day